I'm over here trying to mine is ether on demand. Like internet. <laughs> yeah, they're trying to get ether from uh, crystals to fight these fucking cilions or whatever. But I can't find the last little glowy piece. I'm supposed to be looking around in this area and there is jack shit nothing. Did you uh, do the ones where you had to reveal the evil sil sils? Yeah. And you find everybody that's in the scions and they start poofing the little purple things. Yeah. Yeah, I did that one a little while back. Feels like eons ago. Oh, where the fuck is this thing at? Before I go nuts. Boom, 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 boom. Bang, 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 bang. I wonder if it's on the side of the cliff Whoa. somewhere. I think I got wrecked. <laughs> Did he? When I activate my, uh... Power my injury powers? Solo song, the one that just buffs me. Yeah. Things like Insta Day. Oh, really? Uh -huh. Damn. Mother's getting wrecked. I have one now that uh, stacks with my group buff. It's mm -hmm. called. Hold on. Your mother, Trebek? Uh, Army's Peon. When you activate that, it gives a team a 20% chance to grant a repertoire. And over time, it deals. Venomous Bite or Clan Bite, that gives that to the party. Nice. Then you activate Battle Voice, which increases the direct hit rate of all party members by 20%. So they Damn. get harder. So you can start fucking wrecking all kinds of shit. Well, I can't. That well, doesn't do me any benefit. That does the party. The party in whole, though, can start fucking shit up. Oh, and it also uh, increases potency of attack by 100. Wank all members. See? Your class is pretty kick-ass. It also increases the direct hit rate by 3%. Holy crap. Do you know, was uh, you going to be the machine? You're going into what? the mechanist? Nah, no, not yet. I can't until I finish. Are you going to be, are you going to be a gunbreaker? Uh, I don't know. I found out that the gunbreakers are technically tanks. I did not know that. Huh. I thought they were like DPS, but their moves are a DPS set, but they act as a tank. Uh, is that a question? Yeah, probably eventually switch to Mechanist, but I'm gonna keep going with the uh, Bard until as high as I can get the Blade. Right. Their, the utility is pretty good on them. And yeah, it is. It's pretty nice uh, with all the buffs and everything. I cannot find this damn thing. Oh shit, there's stairs up there. I bet it's up there. Damn, I've been around this whole camp like nine times. Yep, I guarantee it's up here. Maybe? I had the one where the kids were hiding. Not find that kid for the life of me. Yeah, he's in like the corner. I had to it. He's like wedged up in the corner, isn't he? The one by the entrance. Well, so the one that I was looking for at the last, like I found that one right away. It's the one that I ended up needing. Um, the one that was in next to the waking sands, next to that table. Oh. Like, really? Like on the very edge of the circle. Yeah, that's some bullshit. I can't find yeah, this damn thing. Yeah, pretty rough. I don't know where it is. I've looked everywhere. I looked everywhere. How do I turn in my uh, poetics to get uh, that one gear that you were talking about? Well, Ironworks gear? I'm wearing it right now. Yes, Ironworks. Yep. Uh, you go to Mordona and okay. go to that Aetherite and go up the hill from the Aetherite and go to the right. There'll be a tent with three women in it. And you will want to talk to the one in the middle, I think. One in the middle or the one on the right. But anyways, you'll click on that and then... You will talk to her and then you get like, I think it's battle gear or whatever it is, but she'll have it in there and look for the armor pieces and you'll be able to find them. You can turn other stuff in too to get weapons and that's the girl on the left hand side. I bet it's up there. Oh f it is up there on top of the pipe. I got fucked. Damn it. Okay, here we go. 
the ironworks armor yep which should be that stuff is fucking awesome for a long time so and that's what I've been wearing and I've been getting my next upgrade in armor and it's still not as good as the ironworks it's got the LEDs and shit on it oh damn it Hmm. I don't have the right poetics. Uh, did you look at the currency? How many do you have? Um, different poetics. Uh, the poetics have... you need is the Alice Allegan Stone Tombstone of Poetics. Yeah. Cool. Uh, Ro Rowan. Rowan. I think you can exchange those, okay. but you may have to Google it. No. And an encrypted tombstone. Yeah, I need the Allegan ones of poetics. Oh, that bow is awesome. Yeah, that's pretty cool. They got some pretty awesome weapons there. And they got different versions of them, too. And you can only use poetics to get this stuff. You can't, like, buy them on the marketplace or anything like that shit. Okay. That I know of, anyways. They might have changed the rules since then, but... Um, there's little subtle things that I remember, and, like... I'll talk to Ice or Tori, and they're like, No, it's this way. now." I'm like, what? <laughs> Are you smoking? What is D-O-W? Breath of the Wild. No, D-O-W and D-O-M. Oh, it's the... Oh, Disciples of War. Um, uh, armor. Okay, just there. Okay. Okay, so I am not that. I am... Well, Disciple, right like, if it's D-O-M, it's Disciple of Magic. If it's D-O-W, it stands for Disciple of... War, which is like Archer, Marauder, uh, Gladiator, okay. and Pugilist. So your Archer would be a Disciple of War. Okay. Holy crap. Okay, wow, I can buy some of this. Mm-hmm. Bum, 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 bum. <laughs> Got that tune, that rockin' tune jamming in my ear hole. Which one? I don't know, whatever is at this camp. Whichever uh. this is the... Corillium, Cerulean Processing Plant. I literally been waiting all day to get on. Yeah, I haven't been on. I really shouldn't be on right now in case my it's on, but it's kind of slow right now. So I'm just tell them that your character's on AFK. <laughs> well, right now it's not. <laughs> oh well. Oh, so you do the so your seller, uh, what do you call those? Huh? Person that sells things. For oh, you. um, your retainer. Retainer. People have been saying that they send them on quests. How do you send them on quests? Mm -hmm. You can uh, equip them with uh, stuff like mine's a miner, and then I okay. send her out with mining gear and stuff like that, and then I have her go and mine crystals for me. So I don't have to do it. She does it. Can yeah. you tell her what to mine? Or? Uh, I think she just mines whatever, and then you pick the area that she mines in, I think, if I remember right. Or he, or who, whatever your retainer is. Um, yeah, and then... Her name's Elsie. Nice. <laughs> um, <laughs> that's funny. Uh, but yeah, you can put any... Not just any armor, but you can put a majority of armor on them. Um, okay. To make them look a little cooler. Uh, you can also send them down to investigate the area, and they'll get ranks. And eventually, through your grand company, you'll get a whole team of people that you send out. So you'll get, like, uh, a warrior or a paladin... And then you'll get a DPS, and you'll get a healer, and you'll get a group of them. And you'll be in charge of them. And then you can send them out and do shit for you and fight battles. Okay. It's kind of cool. You get in there, and you have to train them and everything. It's pretty interesting. Nice. Yeah, there's there's so much shit to this game. It's ridiculous sometimes. I'm like, what the f***? I'm like, oh, yeah. And there's a lot of stuff that I just forgot because I don't use it, you know? So, like, there's certain things I do in this game. And, you know, like, Ice will be very particular how he gets, like, certain Ultima weapons or Ultima weapons. Um, there's, there's like, 15 different ones you can get, and I like to get mine in a row. But now they've made it to where you can skip certain steps and turn them in and get different ones. But some of them look kind of cool. Uh, if you want to see your weapons, I would just YouTube it real quick, and they'll show you. All the stuff that's available for your particular class. Um, they got some pretty awesome shit, though. There's some paladin weapons I have that just fucking in the armor. It all glows and does some crazy shit. And some of the max move stuff that I get. Uh, which you won't learn until you're further into Heaven's Ward. And, like, even when you get to endgame in this game, it's not technically endgame. 
there's so much shit after the end game that they have that you could do um, in dungeons and raids and all this other shit that like yeah it's yeah. way too cracked out some of it is so yeah, I noticed I've, I've got like a single heaven's word quest but I haven't been doing it because I've been trying to get the story to get more of them right and then a lot of it leads up into it you're technically because you haven't been to Ishgard yet have you have you, uh, you go through that big red gate I don't think if you're not I'm not even through there yet um, that's when you're technically so. in Heaven's Ward. Is when you go. There's a gate in Dragonhead or Camp Dragonhead, uh, right to the northwest of it. And there's a gate right there you can't go through, and that's that's the expanded area. All kinds of the crazy shit. So that's why people like when they say like Final Fantasy. You know, there's, yeah, it's a slow start, but once you start getting to the bigger shit, it really flushes out in big way. So. Now that I can't remember much on, you're gonna have to look that up, because you can exchange uh, tones and you can exchange uh, different currency for other currency to buy things, or you can turn in weapons too. I think you can turn in shit to them, and then you can trade that off. And a lot of it's just doing dungeons. So like I was thinking, when we get high enough of a level. And you want to grind for this shit? You and me can just hop on, and we can just unsync dungeons and run through them. Right. Yeah, right now we're we're peasants. The gloves. I got everything except for the the body, the chest piece, and the legs for the armor. I haven't gotten any of the uh, jewelry stuff yet. Are you still over there? Yeah. I'll I'll, I'll head over your way. See okay. what they got. Um, let me. Yeah, there's a bunch of stuff on this third one, but I don't know what any of it is for the ironworks gear. Yeah, you gotta turn shit in for it, and it's stuff that's... They have that bow, but I can't get that yet. Let me... I'll get over there and see what I can help you figure out. Let me finish this beast. Apparently I need... All I can think of is that, that Lord Bolio guy from the guild. <laughs> He's like, where will I quest today? Uh -oh. <laughs> You remember him? He's like the guy that dresses in the red and he's got like the white wig on and shit. Yeah. Lord Bolio. Alright, um, I should be able to fly right to you. Okay, yeah, so the tombstones, the Allegan tombstones, you have those? And you can do a Goetia exchange too, but I don't think I can do them right now. You have to open that up. Uh, so I need like the ones of war and then I go to the tab over for armor. Yeah, I don't have that. Teleport to Ethernet. Weird. I have no huh. idea. The, I, I put all mine in uh, the general chat. I tried okay. multiple of them. Okay, so. Alright, I'm like, is that which one you're talking about? Yeah, the middle one. I go to her. Okay. And then and I click, then... I click uh, the top one, poetics, and then the first one that shows up should be weapons, and the only one that shows up for me is shield, because I think she only does armor. So I hit. Yeah, so, I, so there's weapons, armor, accessories, and others. So I go to the accessories tab because that's what I'm buying. It's a bunch of shit there. Or you can go over to the token exchange, but you have to get tokens, uh, which isn't unlocked yet. This is a place for later on. And there's the stuff here on the left hand side. This is shit you get from doing other things, like the primal gear. You can get for turning in other stuff. So, like, if I want the tidal wave sham, shamshar or whatever, I have to have first the wave shamshar weapon, and I have to get a mirror of war, and then she'll give me that updated weapon, which is actually worse than what I got on me right now. So I got my shiny shit now, buddy. Nice. It's pretty fucking awesome sauce. And that's not even my animal weapon. This is like a regular... But they got primal weapons underneath it is the masterworks. Uh, let's see. And some of these are kind of cool. Um, you just gotta have the Rowan, Rowanus tokens. Yeah, and the Allegan tombstones. I think you get those from running. Or, uh. Damn. I think you get those from running, uh, against the Empire or the Galleon. Or Garland? Empire? I can't remember where you get them from though. I'll have to look that up again. 
see what else we got. Ironworks here. Yeah, and then you get your sword. Uh, I don't even know if I have any of these. I don't have any of these yet. Which is weird, so it must be something that... No, see, like, okay, so if you go down to Ironworks gear on the on the left-hand side check, you know, let's say you have the Ironworks Magitech bow. If you hit that button and you have it and you want to exchange it, um, she'll give you the 10 Rowan's tokens and the encrypted tombstone for it. Okay. And then you turn around and then pick on, like, the single-handed arm weapons. And so, let's say you need... Oh, wow, you can do the scepter for that. That's cool. Um, but anyways, you're just exchanging shit. So, like, you want the primal gear, so... I'll exchange my ironworks weapon, the the break blade, for her, and she'll give me what I need. And then I'll go around, turn around, and I'll get on primal gear, and I'll... Or wherever, and trade for it. Or the, the Geralt's masterworks, that's what it is. There it is. So I can get the weathered Bertang... Bert game? Okay, so I need an elfin bow... But if it's better, you know, you can do the two. Wow, these are from ages shit though. Uncanny knickknacks. But not all this stuff is like great, really at all. But some of it is. Wow, that fucking one gear here though. Holy shit, that's awesome. That fucking holy shit. That is a level 50 armor, and it gives me plus 327 defense. And 327 magic defense, so it ups me almost 400 points on my defense. Yeah. Just for a level 50. Holy fucking balls. You get barding in here too. So these are drops, you gotta exchange this shit out for drops. Bahamut mask. Black summer top. Ooh, I can exchange my shit out. I forgot. This is where I get it. Oh, yeah. Oh, I can't get the halter top, eh? What about the trunks? I can buy the old swim trunks. Those look ridiculous. You can see my junk like a champ. Alright. You're fine. So me and Tori and Tani tried doing uh, Ramu on Extreme, and we were f***ing just getting obliterated. We tried it for a half an hour with this full party trying to get it done, and we just couldn't do it. So eventually Lorelei popped on and Ice was on. He's like, alright, let's do this. And they did it unsynced and blew him out. I got, wait, Ramu? Is that the, that's the beard guy, right? Yep. Yeah, we did him uh, on easy, or on regular, yeah. starting on the He's day. not so bad there, but yeah, when you start getting to extreme and savage, holy fucking balls. This extreme is too crazy because everybody's got to know the mechanics. And yeah. everybody's got a certain job. You know, like I got to grab orbs, so I get protector, he blasts and kill. He like... One shot kills everybody in the whole party. If you're not careful. Why is all this stuff market prohibited? Damn it. Yeah, some of it's spirit bonded to you. Oh, there are things that I haven't even used. They're like monk shit. Um, there might be items Hold you on. picked up I through quests. Okay. And you can't sell that stuff. The beast seemed peckish, so I gave it a taste of my axe. I know, I know, as Urianger never tires of reminding me, an axe ill becometh the hand of a scholar. <sighs> what can I say? I like axes. To hear my mother tell it, I came into this world holding one. And it's not as if it stopped me picking up a quill, is it? <laughs> I often think of the man who introduced me to the joys of learning. He's one of the reasons I decided to come to Eorzea. Him and my excruciatingly stiff childhood friend. Considering how unalike we are, it's a wonder we ever got on. <laughs> Aye, that ought to do it. So far, so good. At these concentrations, it shouldn't matter too much if something goes awry. Just enough ether to make it interesting. Did you see that? The way the crystal glowed? The siphon works, I'm happy to say. With a few refinements, it should satisfy our appetite for ether. Which just leaves the small matter of forging our blade. 
I'm not sure how to go about it just yet, but I swear to find a way. I'll put a blade in your hands if it's the last thing I do. He senses me. A useful talent. Anassian, are they on to us? By your brand, I see you are an Archon of Charlian, keeper of knowledge, seeker of truth. I don't know what the hell's you're saying, but I don't much like your tone. <laughs> your instincts serve you well. But come, be not unsettled on my account. That lovely brow was not made for frowns. Ah, uh, but I waste my breath. Let me direct my words to one who understands them. We meet at last, warrior of light. I am Nabrialis. And you have long been a thorn in my side. I suffered the overweening presence of Lahabrea that men might host the power of gods, only for you to undo my hard work. Oh, bugger. Oh. Do settle down. You must concede that I acted in self-defense. But what's this? I do not sense the blessing of light. Oh, dear. Could it be that frail Hydlin has forgotten her champion? This I did not foresee. Shorn of light as you are, you are no longer a threat. And better yet, the seal is broken. Now is the time to claim the staff. With it in my grasp, I shall rise above them all and take my place at Lord Zodiac's right hand. What did that bastard want with us? Nobrialis, he calls himself. <laughs> with charm like that, I'll bet he has maidens falling at his feet. Unconscious. But this staff... You say just talking about it had the bastard grinning like a brat on his name day. Huh. <laughs> Must be quite a staff. Oh, gods. He means Tupsimati. Master Louis Soir's staff. Minfilia's in danger. We have to get back to the Rising Stones. It's pretty intense. Intense. Yep. Whoa, some chick's getting her ass smacked. And I'll fight it off and she won't even thank me. There we go. Maybe this also. History. Oh. <laughs> she did thank me. What do you know? Shocked, I tell you. Are you still going through your inventory? Yeah. Got all that garbage in there? <laughs> Been eating your food? Ah, uh, yep. Eat it up, eat it up. I normally do it before I done to dinner or something. And then beat it up, beat it up. Oh no, the staff's gone. You too! I'm gonna beat him so, over the head. you were able to divine my intent. What now, warrior of light? Ah, but that name is no longer fitting. You have become decidedly dull and quite incapable of barring my entry. What do you mean? You truly do not know. Wait, then I suppose it is only right that I enlighten you. you. Yeah, that was one of the things that she said I the could blessing for. of light can, you, can you and your fellow meddlers Let's safe. go find out. It was that which prevented my kind from entering your domain. 
This guy's freaking voice is intense. He's My like the kind, creepy lurch guy. Though it had no power over the likes of Elidibus and La Habrea, being of this world, they could come and go as they please, while I could only look on. But I Hello, need look Clarice. no longer. Now like. that the seal is gone, I mean to act. Unlike the others, I am not given to waiting. I shall take that staff and bring about the and next shove right rejoining. Up Rejoining? Then it was your doing. The Isle of Val, the scholars, all of it. Did you just poof over there? You will not harm her! Unable to complete exchange. <laughs> oh, damn. You can only possess one of that. Moonbreeder! Okay, I have that item. I want to exchange. Why must you insist on forcing my hand? Did you learn nothing from our last meeting? Ah, but I forget. My words fall upon deaf ears. This is the Kingdom Hearts, guys. The staff is but a broken relic. A memorial to the departed. What possible use could you have for it? I'll post it on my wall. Talking about her dad's staff what or her grandpa's use? staff or whatever. You mean to say that all this time you kept the key, never knowing what it was you possessed? The staff Tupsimati, or rather the stone tablet it bears, is host to a great power. Together with the horn, it can be used to draw vast quantities of ether from its bearer's surroundings. How else do you think Louis Soi was able to invoke the power of the Twelve without making them an offering of crystals? Summoning requires not only prayer, but a profusion of ether. Even a child knows so that. I have this bow, if I did not know before, you may be certain I do now. Hmm. But above all, I know that we cannot allow the staff to fall into your hands. I will die before I let you take it. Insufferable right. So you gotta find what I they need for end your miserable life. <laughs> And now, alas, Elidibus would never let me hear the end of it. Okay. Very well. well. I'll deal with that if later, you will not part with the staff, I will take you too. Alright, let's see. Damn, I'm powerless to stop him. them quickly before the rift closes nope oh, time to jump into the fire and frying pan Still playing inventory Tetris? Yep. How's that going? Uh, not bad. Like, I am undercutting people and that are selling stuff, and I'm selling it for less than they can buy it hmm. at, uh... Oh, shoot. Maybe not. <laughs> oh, well. They can buy it for three sixty-five at the um, vendor person, but it's selling for fifteen hundred. I marked it for a thousand, and hopefully someone's lazy and just wants to buy it, buy it at the market board. There you go. Not a bad deal. Yeah. 
Limza Lominza.